Hi, my name is Lorna Holland. I'm one of the owners and tour directors for Vafeltre Tours. Today I wanted to go over my ladies only tour with you. I've been getting a lot of questions from people and I thought maybe this video would help you out. Uh, definitely after the video, feel free to visit our website and feel free to call or text me. I'm always here for questions. So the ladies only tour has come about because I've actually had quite a few women who either are solo travelers or maybe mom and daughter or best friends and they want to economize their travel but they don't necessarily have a large group to travel with. So my tours are perfect for people like you who are looking for a way to travel, travel safely, um, travel efficiently and still have lots of fun. My ladies only trip starts in Rome. We go on to Florence, Tuscany, we go up to the Dolomites and down to Venice. In the summers, I also offer an Amalfi extension. For what's included on the tour, in Rome, we have the Roman Forum, the Colosseum, the Vatican. We also have a local tour guide who takes us around and gives us some more uh, information about the city and the history. When we get to Florence, we see the David, we go to the Uffizi Gallery. We also go out to Tuscany and have a wonderful um, tasting and lunch at a vineyard, which is actually all included. And we go see San Gimignano and Siena as well. Up in the Dolomites, this is actually the part of Italy where we live, so we love to show it off. We'll be up in the Italian Alps, more on the Austrian side, just to give you an idea. And uh, we'll hopefully, as long as the weather is good, we always get some amazing views of the Dolomite range, as well as different food from the rest of Italy, things that people don't necessarily expect. From there, we loop around and we end our trip in Venice. We have a guided tour as well as a chance to ride on the gondola, get that last minute glass shopping in, and then of course the tour is over. The tour includes all of that itinerary, all of the entrance fees and the guides. I will be with you from start to finish. I actually keep the group sizes small. I like to have between about six to 12 ladies on my trip so that I'm there for translations. I'm still there to help you. I feel like if the group gets too large, then I actually, you end up losing out on a large part of what I can offer. That's included the uh, hotel, the transportation between towns, the entrance fees as listed on the itinerary are all included. Not included in the tour package are the airfare and um, meals. Breakfast is included every day and we do have our Tuscan wine lunch. But one thing I found with especially the small groups is that you end up with one person who only wants an antipasto for dinner, somebody else who wanted maybe three dishes and then it becomes very unfair because different people are paying different prices for too much or too little food. And for the airfare, uh, I've had women come from different countries, so not always from the United States like myself, and it obviously becomes difficult to price in the airfare. So the package price is the land only package price, and then I can help you with booking your airfare or you can do that completely separately. Obviously, if you wanna use mileage or something of that sort, that's your choice. We do encourage every single passenger to have a comprehensive travel insurance policy. After 2020, everything has been a little crazy in the world and we just wanna make sure that you have cancellation for any reason and trip interruption for any reason because obviously we now know any reason can happen. So uh, if you need help with that, I'm more than happy to refer you to our, tra our uh, travel insurance agent. And of course, that's something that you can purchase on your own as well. So what actually makes my tours different? Uh, I have been a tour director for almost 20 years. Uh, I started out on the East Coast in the US and then I met my husband over in Rome. Um, what I started finding was more and more women were asking me if I could help take care of them on their tours over there. And I realized that this is actually a niche that I have. It's a service that I can offer. And it's very overwhelming to me when I'm on my tours to actually realize that I'm not just helping people as a tour guide and as a tour director and the role that I've had before. I think that 
as we are moving forward, I'm really helping empower women in a way that we haven't really had. Um, there's a huge market out there for solo women travelers. And for me to be on my side of the role and to watch women who apply for their passport after speaking with me and get on a plane and cross the ocean for the first time and feel comfortable and are like crying hugging me at the airport when they leave their trip. There's nothing I can tell you that makes me more proud of the job that I have. Um, I love what I do and I really hope to have you along on one of my tours too. What sets me apart from other tour operators is that I'm not just the person in the office who sends you out on a tour and then you're given a tour manager. I am the person who is now talking to you. I'm the one who's going to answer the phone. I'm the one who's doing the bookings for the trip and I'm the one who goes along on the trip. I know all of our vendors. I know what food we're going to have. I'm there from the moment you land until the moment you check into the airport. It's kind of my signature. Um, I am there to take care of you as much as possible. And of course, if you want some time to go wander by yourself, I'm always there to give you pointers and directions and safety. But at the same time, if you are excited to visit another country, but nervous about being somewhere with another language and sights and sounds and smells, I am there to make this as enjoyable and comfortable as possible. And I really think that when you're on vacation, you shouldn't have to do the thinking. That's what I'm there for. So I uh, really encourage you to go to the website vafeltre.com click on the ladies only tour. We also have some other videos. Uh, I might be able to answer some other questions you have there. And please, again, anytime you can call, you can text, you can email me. I'm always here for you. And I look forward to seeing you in Italy.